Hi, let's talk about what is earnest money. A lot of times a, a buyer asks, um, what is earnest money and what are they um, going to need to do for earnest money? Uh, like everything else in the contract, it is negotiable, but it is pretty common to put down earnest money because what that is, is it's a good faith dollar amount that you're telling the seller, um, I'm putting some money into this transaction. I'm serious. I'm not just going to write up this contract and then walk away. Um, however, just so you know, that earnest money does not go directly to the seller. It gets held in a trust account, sometime with the listing broker, sometimes with their attorney, sometimes with a title company who's going to close the transaction. And earnest money varies depending on the property value and the price of the property that you're purchasing. It might be $500, it might be $1,000, it might be two, three, four, or $5,000. Um, so it just really depends. And again, very negotiable and depending on what everyone is comfortable with. Some certain types of loans will also require that you have a certain dollar amount into the transaction. USDA, for example, requires that you have $1,000 of your own money into the transaction. So typically your lender will require that that's just what you go ahead and put down for earnest money because then that money is there and they can show that you have already put money into the transaction. Hope that helps a little bit. If you have other questions, please comment below, send us a message or send us a text. We look forward to helping you. Thank you for having a great day.